<clears throat> All right, hello, everybody. Welcome back to Live with Blood Ninja. So, while we're loading up this stuff and things here, we're um. We're going back to the server. All right. Server is Lord of the Rings. RP. It's right there. And it says server at the end. You don't have to type it. I just type Lord of the Rings most of the time. All right. But uh, once it's loaded up and everything. Like I said, there's different races, um, and we started rebuilding again because some things did go down. Like we had a admin wipe the server, and he is no longer with us because dad been wiped the server because he is a jerk. So we are at time of peace right now and Monday we will be able to go back to being a regular server and that's only like two or three more days. Yeah, uh, three more days because today's Friday. So three more days till we uh, can go back to being a regular server and have a little bit of PvP. The orcs can raid, we can raid the orcs. I'm thinking um, about I'm at work, so I'm thinking Monday I'm I'm gonna go and uh, just start reading random people and probably show videos of that. Like we should. We should be able to go and find a good, good place to terrorize as works. Uh, once the uh, server is finally up and running, everybody's built. Right now, if you joined this weekend and uh, you want to be part of, like we we need hobbits, cause uh, a lot of hobbits are left. So if if you want to join. And you want to uh, be a hobbit, or if you want to join and be a, a dwarf, like I think there's only like two dwarfs, three dwarfs now. But if you want to join and be a dwarf or a hobbit, or um, you can even be an orc if you want. I mean, there's only like I think there's like six of us. Uh, you could be an elf that has like twelve people. And uh, the tames and stuff I said in the last video is still accurate. So, the tames and stuff are still accurate. We, like, uh, I'll go down there in a minute and show you some stuff and things. But, uh, this is the org base, like I said. Oh, I just lagged the heck out. I'll try it one more time. But, um. That was the orc base right there. And. Oh, there's somebody else online, I think. No. The hobbits, I don't think they actually have a capital yet. And we're not allowed to raid capitals unless you declare war. And so just don't declare war in your capital and never be broken. <laughs> like, if you want to be a hobbit, they can, um. Uh, they'll give you a GCL mode to let you build up. And then you, you can, if you're the first one, you can be a leader. You can be a hobbit leader. 
or also if you don't want to join let's say you want to be an elf but you don't want to live with the elves you don't want to be in the capital you can also be in a, still be an elf and just be a branch off of the elves you make your own tribe if you have friends you want to play with um So like for us, we already have two dwarf tribes. We have the dwarf king, which runs the kingdom, and then we have a, another dwarf tribe that technically, like they're they're dwarfs, but they're not a kingdom, if that makes sense. And then we have well, we got three spinos and stuff. I tamed a bunch of stuff. Uh, that's all I do is tame for the orcs because we didn't have <laughs> as you see we don't really have much so I try to help out alright but um basically that's the orc base right there uh it's not great it's not that like the worst the entrance is over here um, we got a tower that's over here that the owner of the server actually made us. Shout out to Purple for helping on the base over there. Uh, the owner of the server, Luna, she actually uh, built this that right here for us. So I'm giving her a shout out. Hopefully my wavering doesn't do stupid crap and run away again. Alright. So. This is what she made us. Let's just check. Okay, he's not being stupid. Watch him wait until I'm at the top of the freaking tower. She made like a eye of Mordor. That's what that's supposed to be. At night it looks freaking cool. I might break these flags and uh, go back and put the other type of flag. Because we have the manticore flag. So I might actually break these flags and put the manticore flag. But uh, this is our other thing. <clears throat> this ain't all about us guys. I was just this is all I'm allowed to show though like I can't go into other people's bases. And uh I think this is kinda funny because like if you're like really short you can just like go in here or if you're really tall you have to open the top one. I don't know, we gotta decorate this. I haven't really decorated it yet. I'm gonna try to get GCL mode and decorate it. But if you join the orcs, you can help us out. Like, uh, if you don't wanna live in the capital with us, you could always just live here or build your own place. You know, I mean, just die. Right, that's what I wanted to show you guys. But, um, I was thinking about turning this into a, uh, public area for the orcs, even, like, the ones that don't join us. They make their own orc tribe, I was going to try to, like, maybe if they're peaceful with us and don't want to fight us, because right now they're talking mad crap. Maybe letting them uh, use this and like having like some construction tables and whatnot in here for them to use, but or at, if we get more people on the orc side, we can 
let them live here and kind of defend this area and watch over this if they don't want to build their own base but yeah I'm probably going to take these flags down and put the manticore flags which means I need two four six eight probably ten yeah okay probably ten flags yeah that's a tech teleporter it's just so she can come and give us GCM. Oh, there's more. Jesus. Alright. I'm, uh, I'm gonna change it around. When Luna gets on, I'm gonna ask for GCM and get rid of these flags and put the other flags. Um. But. These right here will actually be gone. when we have uh... When we, when we have everything back to the way it's supposed to be these will actually be gone there's no need to really worry and be like oh I got tech no we, we don't have tech guys like there's three tech teleporters. One of them's a starter. I think this one's a starter. Is it going? Alright, so when you join the server, you want to spawn. And when you spawn, you spawn beat zone one. Do not worry about these plants. These plants will not hurt you. You gotta come over here. And you're gonna read. Like they had some fish here, that was pretty cool. But you're gonna come over here. You're gonna you're gonna get one of these RGs, okay? But not yet. I'm dropping ahead of myself. You're gonna come here. You're gonna read. You're gonna read all these rules. Some of these rules may have changed, so I'm gonna from the last video. So I'm gonna see what's going on. No raiding kingdom. You can only raid cities and villages. Territory is allowed. Uh, territory is already assigned to races and their prospective kingdoms. Please read the races page for more info. PvP is allowed only for orcs. They can kill you and you can kill them. So good luck. No killing passive tames. No modern weapon allowed, which means no guns, nor motorboats, tech, or metal structures. There is no admin shop, so instead kingdoms will have control over certain dinos that can't be tamed on the m map. More info on race page. Currently, currency is black pearls. I don't know where to farm black pearls. No meshing racism or sexist things allowed. You will be banned. You cannot tame another race special tame. I will kill them. No hesitation. So like, you can't go get Ice Wavered Egg and say and hatch it and raise it. She'll kill it. The only time you can raid a kingdom capital is if another kingdom declares war. Did she put an E as R? That's funny. On that kingdom, there are five different races to choose from, which I was talking about. All with special tames and territory. Head to the right to read about them. Here's the starters right here. Tamer. Starter Tamer starter he gets hot armor. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be ascendant. Crossbow, trank arrows, two hundred, fifty kibble, meat, metal pick, and hatchet. I'm pretty sure the crossbow and the armor are ascended. Don't know about the pick and hatchet. Builder starter. Hide armor. Hundred stone walls. Floor. Roof door and frame. Forge. You get forges, metal, pick, and hatchet. I think the metal pick and hatchet on this one is is supposed to be ascended. Don't quote me on that. And then here's the warrior starter, metal armor. Yeah, metal armor, battle axe, sword, 
metal pick, and a hatchet. Okay, I know the armor and a battle axe and a sword are definitely ascended. And I know the pick and the hatchet is not. Because I started as a warrior myself, guys. Alrighty. And I know the crossbow is definitely ascended. I don't know about the armor, but I think it is. My friend started off. I'd have to see what he got. So, elves. They have ice wavens, snow elf, unicorn. Their locations is redwoods and tundra zone. So you can't tame ice wavens, snow owl, or a unicorn. Unless you're an elf. Alright. Please contact Lazy. Alright, that's Luna. Or Purple Magic. To join the Elven Kingdom of Lord of the War. See, Luna is the admin. Purple is like the right hand person. Like, alright, race. Hobbits, Thames, Lightning Wavering, Gotchas, and Dinanicus. They would be good because they got Gotchas. As long as you keep feeding those, you can get Ascended stuff. Location, Chalk Hills. Race, George, Thames, Poison Wavering, Rock Drake, Roll Rat, Location, Aberration Caves. So you get Poison, Roll Rats, and Rock Drake. And there's no one to contact there. So, there's no one to contact on there. So, I'm pretty sure since there's no one to contact on both of those. Maybe the dwarf guy quit. And then over here, we need hobbits. We need a hobbit leader. Since there's no one to contact. So, we might need a dwarf king. Humans, Thames, Fire, Waver, and Griffin, and Velonosaur, Location, Jungle, Area. There's nobody to contact there. So, uh, we might can have a human leader. But I thought Tia was... I thought Tia was the humans. Did she qu I don't know if she quit. And then over here for Elves... I mean, uh... For... For the, uh... Hobbits, I know there's nobody. And then, I don't know if... Dark Wolf quit or not, but he was the uh, leader of that. So, um, I didn't quit hitting things last time a freaking Polovia came out. Anyway, race orc. You get Thames, Crope the Wavern, Crope the Raptor, uh, Ravengers, and your location is Snow Biome. Plain and simple. Contact Army Strong or me. To join the Orc Kingdom of Mordor. So. We're the Orc Kingdom. You can be an Orc. You don't have to work with us. You can just be a different tribe. But you can't be a Kingdom. So. That's about it guys. Then after you read all that. Most likely Luna. Will be on. Because she's. She's active. So she might be on. She might be standing here. And then she's going to tell you. Pick one. So you're going to walk up. I'm gonna look at the RGs. You're gonna pick one. She's gonna ask you, "What do you want, tamer, builder, or do you want warrior?" You tell her that. She's gonna put all the stuff. Let's say you pick this bird. She put all the stuff in this bird, and then she's gonna claim it and give it to you. Honestly, guys, if I knew what I knew now, I would have picked tamer. And the reason I would have picked tamer. Is because you get kibble, and kibble is a lot easier to tame with. <laughs> so, kibble is a lot easier to tame with. We, uh. Moving on. Uh, we need hobbits for, I know for a fact. I think Tia is the human leader. I think she took that role. And I think the dwarf role is... Dark Wolf, if he's still in. 
and if you guys really want just go and join the server pick what race you want if you don't want to be part of the kingdom because you want to do your own thing just know you can't pvp unless it's with the orcs and just know that um you're gonna have to you're gonna have to do some stuff like you have to build up which monday the gcm ends so you guys gotta hurry up and uh, get on and rebuild dudes because if if you're if Monday she's not gonna give GCM anymore so you got Friday Saturday Sunday and GCM is so easy to build your own little kingdom <laughs> you can just spawn in stuff to build um Like I don't know, I I would honestly recommend if you want a good roleplay server, I recommend joining here, and I recommend actually um, not a lot of these crowd pots and stuff. So that's kind of weird that it's in there, but we're I recommend you guys join quickly. You, Get the GCM so you guys can build up. Um, I I would even if you join and and you don't think you're gonna be able to build up fast enough before Monday, I would just like put some extra walls and st other structures that you might need inside because. You can always just store them in something, and then that way you'll have them to build, even if you can't build right off the bat. And the server is actually really good. Like, yeah, we every server is going to get griefers. Every server is going to get something bad every once in a while. So it's not like the admins aren't trying. They actually, they actually are. And I think I found whose base is this? this temp tribe. So I guess they're a temporary tribe and they're trying to figure out where they want to go. Because they probably haven't picked the race yet. I would... <laughs> I would so read that. I have to wait until Monday though. I don't even want this metal, what am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? I don't even want this. Alright. But yeah, I mean... If I wanted the metal, I'll go get a freaking Aki. So yeah guys, that's basically all I wanted to say is that we should join the server, get some more people in, like, and actually roleplay, have some fun. I never really roleplayed, so I kind of want to see how this works out, and we kind of want to know what's going on with the roleplay and stuff, and it, this server seems cool. I mean, the, the owner, she tries 
to actually be on as much as possible and she tries to deal with everything as much as possible. So... The, the taming's kinda, kinda fast. I mean, it's like 10 times. The, um... <laughs> the damage and the boost and stuff. Like, if you wanna look at my character, like, I got a, a thousand melee. See, like, I got I gotta work on my way a little bit. It's not too boosted, but it is good. I mean, I got 900 health. Um, I'm thinking about going for a little bit more weight, cause I got three more points. You can go to 105, and I'm thinking about going for probably 300 weight. Try to see if there's any good drops around too, but I'm probably gonna go for about 300 weight, and probably a thousand health. And that would probably be like three points, and then I should be good. Uh, I could always make a mind wipe and redo everything if I don't like it. Uh, wish the weight was boosted a little bit more because the server is five times. Alright, a shield and a saddle that I'm probably not going to use. Okay, shield, saddle. And yeah, I have two sets of wrapped. The one crappy set, and I have my good set. But I'll get into that later. Anyway. Um, I still want to, I want to go fix that tower, but I can't, yeah, that's the way until Luna gets on. Alright. If you get GCM. You're probably going to think, yeah, I can spawn cryopods in. And I can transport dinos. Well, let me just tell you guys right now. That was the stupidest idea I ever had. Because if the server goes down since they're not in the server. Guess what, boys? You lost your, uh... You lost it. You lost your stuff. You lost your, uh, tames. Lost everything. So don't do that either. Hey, right? I mean, just just build, maybe build you a a city or whatever. And if you're in a a kingdom, ask if you're a kingdom leader. Like if you join the hobbits or the dwarfs or the humans, because they don't have anybody pulling the board. And the leaders I know probably quit. So like, if you uh, join them and they say you could be a leader of them, and make your own kingdom, just just build your kingdom, guys. Build you a couple of traps to tame stuff in your area, and just just leave it at that. Cause I mean, the cryopods, I uh, don't don't do it. That was something I learned. I screwed up on. I I would have had another. Another three more Spinos, and I would have had another three more Baryonyxes if that didn't happen to me. So, and you don't know when the server's going to lag you out, and you don't know when the server's going to, like, just completely shut down just so Luna can uh, change some stuff. Because if you tell her something's on a server, she'll actually like uh, try to fix it like we told her the tame it takes forever and she tweaked it a little bit we told her the fishing sucked she tweaked that a little bit uh, we told her the drops suck she tried to tweak that a little bit 
Now we're getting ascended like blueprints and ascended uh saddles and stuff, so And uh, I can use some help on the orcs, like the orcs. We like we we actually don't have any grinders. We don't have any tamers. I've been doing a lot of it, so I I can use some help if you guys want to join orcs. I mean, you can live in the the eye of Mordor, or you can live with us over here, or you can build your own house. So that being said, guys, have a wonderful day. Stay roguey. And uh, come check out the server, guys.